Hello everyone. We are here today at the Mont Saint-Michel, which is the most visited place in France. Visitors are ignoring that here we were at the highest peak of the former continent. We were almost touching the stars. In a previous video, we presented a single head configuration used in static mode. Here we have a test setup with two optical heads mounted on a two-axis rotating table. The two optical heads are separated by 30 degrees. Just need to test this configuration. After switching on the star tracker, the acquisition is performed on the reference head in full frame image in less than four seconds. One, two, three, four. Then the star tracker switches automatically in tracking mode in sub-windows image mode centered on eight stars per optical head. In this configuration, the attitude is computed at 10 Hz with a total of 16 stars as if we had a total field of view of 60 degrees. Needless to say that the accuracy is much better than other single head star tracker solutions that we can find on the marketplace. In low Earth orbit, the spacecraft has an apparent through rate of less than 0.1 degree per second. Let's test the star tracker at different configurations of through rates. Here, we are pushing the limits of the star tracker at more than 6 degrees per second. Amazing! The second benefit of multiple head configuration is that we can maintain the tracking although one head is blinded or occulted. The tracking with the two heads recovers immediately as soon as occultation is removed. We are here in a noisy environment in terms of stray light but Origa Star Tracker does not care about that. Even the Mont Saint-Michel in the background does not affect the tracking capability of the Star Tracker with the 35 degree sun excellent angle baffle. Of course, for more stringent stray light environment, a 26 degree baffle is also proposed. In high radiation environment, the processing can get rid of the high energy particle effects. No need to come at the Mont Saint-Michel to perform the test. We are also offering ground support equipment, including a dynamic optical equipment and a built-in pattern mode that can be activated through a dedicated telecommand. I hope that you enjoyed that video showing the tracking capability of the Star Tracker. Do not hesitate to visit our website. Bye-bye. Ah là, ça arrive. <rire> Good job. <rire>